The debate over the Uniform Civil Code continues. Network 18 has conducted a mega survey, ladies and gentlemen. India's biggest about the Uniform Civil Code. Over 8,000 Muslim women across 25 states and union territories have been asked about the Uniform Civil Code. And the seven key questions asked in the survey did not make any mention of the UCC and was strictly limited to the themes that the code is likely to cover. The survey participants included women aged 18 to 65 plus. Remember... The Law Commission has sought suggestions from stakeholders for a period of one month, which ends on the 14th of July when it comes to the Uniform Civil Code. Now, let's take you through what we have learned from this mega survey conducted by Network 18. We asked Muslim women, do you support a common law for marriage, divorce, adoption and inheritance? And this is what we found when it comes to that survey, uh, when that big question was asked uh, to Muslim women, when it comes to marriage, divorce, Divorce, adoption and inheritance, a mega survey conducted by Network 18. I'll pose that question again. Do you support a common law for marriage, divorce, adoption, inheritance? Yes, a whopping 67.2%. No, 25.4%. Didn't know, can't say, 7.4%. This is These are the findings, the key findings of the survey on the Uniform Civil Code. So that's what's coming in. This mega survey conducted with over 8,000 Muslim women aged from 18 to 65 plus. We we asked them the key question when it comes to the contentious issues surrounding the Uniform Civil Code. Do you support a common law for marriage, divorce, adoption and inheritance? Yes. A whopping 67.2%, ladies and gentlemen. No. 25.4%. Don't know, can't say, 7.4. So that's what's coming in. Let's get to our guests who are joining us uh, to decode the results of this of this mega survey conducted by Network Green. Zita Shokat Ali, activist and Islamic scholar, is joining us on the broadcast. Ma'am, how do you see this uh, mega uh, survey that's been conducted by uh, Network 18? A whopping six, over 67% of the respondents, that is 8,000 Muslim women uh, from the age groups of 18 to 65 plus, are saying that they are in favor of a common law for marriage, divorce, and inheritance. I think uh, I think it's pointing to the fact that you now Muslim women are, are, are you know are waking up and they uh, you know they they want to see the light of another day and they are uh, you know they are looking forward to uh, being uh, you know given the rights that they deserve and the rights that Islam has always given them, but somehow the other uh, it has, they have been evaded over a period of time due to, you know, uh, interpretations. But uh, I, I think that it is showing a very positive trend. And uh, you see, whatever has been asked is has every is within the purview of Islam also, please let me tell you, that Islam does not uh, factually permit polygamy, it restricts polygamy. And, uh, you know, uh, the other things, the age of marriage and, uh, you know, whatever questions I think that have been posed, are, you know, in consonance with the teachings and understandings of Islam. A girl has to be reaching a, a certain age of intelligence in, in uh, you know, in Surah number 4. It is very clearly mentioned that do not hand over the property to orphans until they, uh, they until they uh, they are at an age, uh, mental age, where they can understand what you're doing to them, what they're going to handle and what, what they will have to handle. So similarly, it is said, based on that, you know, the jurist formed a parallel to say that if property cannot be handed over to her, then where is the question of her whole life and, you know, taking a decision when she's only 13 and 14 years old? Mm -hmm. So, and countries all over the world, uh, let me tell you, have undergone these kind of tremendous changes. They have used different aspects and different facets of the law. And, uh, you know, Islamic law has various instruments. So you find world over that, you know, these laws have, taken different dimensions and I think uh, you know in, in, in with in Muslim women it is showing a, a very positive direction right I'm also joined by